Hunger good, you understand? Yes. And so, ultimatum, uh, and like uh, I've been saying, we've been meeting, and we have received promises, as of promises, promises upon promises, upon ministers of health, and not only one, but many, you know. So that we've received promises, yes. But what do I do with the promise? That's what I call fine English language meeting. Because at the end of the day, I must pay. People who are waiting for me, their creditors must be paid. Those whose drugs we have, you know, gone out there for must be paid. Full stop. So the promises, and now for, for us, these promises and promises, they don't make much sense now. Somebody must make commitment, rule a program that maybe at the end of next month, pick this. Uh, we spread it. So we didn't say six months, we want to pay half, we, we want to pay 70%. Then you go to your bankers and tell them that uh, you get X amount of money as we move uh, on. Now, that is what we want to hear. But because of the policy I mentioned earlier on, that no matter what, the church hospitals uh, don't use strike actions and that kind of thing. Now, that is our challenge. And that is why somebody must respond to this uh, crisis immediately. Because we do something that other, the remaining 60% hospitals don't do. So we must be considered seriously. If tomorrow morning, Konfanochi Kolebu and others are on strike, government will call everybody to go to church hospitals and maybe hospitals like uh, 37 and all that. So if you end up weakening your, next, your safety net, your hospitals that make intervention, you must know what, as a country, we are getting ourselves into. It's a serious issue. 